Hi everybody. So today we are um, videoing from the Golf Learning Center. Over the last couple of days we've gotten a lot of questions from people about golf. And why is golf closed? You can social distance, you can play outside, it meets all the criteria of parks and open space. We wanted to take a moment, and I'm here with Greg Walker, who is our director of golf, to kind of answer this question so that you can understand where we're coming from. You'll note that Greg and I are socially distanced, right? We're trying to be responsible in all forms of our operations at the park district. So we made the decision to close not only our indoor facilities, but also golf, because we want to be really responsible stewards of the public dollars that you entrust to us to take care of and to manage our facilities and to offer safe opportunities to, for, to play throughout the community. Greg's going to talk just a second about the rationale and why we chose to add golf to that inventory. So our demographic in golf here in Peoria is an older demographic. Also, our employees, they tend to be on the older dem demographic side also. With this virus, we know it does affect the older generation a little bit more than the younger generation yep. currently. So we need to make sure that we protect not only our customers and our community members, but also our employees. So we are, the golf industry right now is talking as a collective about some interesting ideas, yep. what we can do in the future with social distancing and how we can change the game a little bit right. to where we can get out there as soon as we possibly can and play this great game. Yep, and we look forward to that. And that's happening, please know that's happening across our district. We're looking at not only golf, but other locations where we can get people back to activity as soon as possible. Um, but we are trying to be so responsible and make sure that we are contributing to the effort to flatten the curve. We are trying to make sure that if we can sacrifice here in the short term, that in the long term we'll be back to playing golf, back to exercising at the Riverplex, back to enjoying animals at the zoo and playing at the Children's Museum as soon as possible. So we ask for your patience, we ask for your understanding. If you see information out there that talks about opportunities for innovation and ways for us to use our facilities wisely and still honor these social distancing requirements and good hygiene and everything else, let us know. We're open to ideas. We want to continue to serve you in the best possible way. But right now, our goal is to keep you safe. And by the way, it's going to rain today, so you're not missing anything. Yes, it is. Have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow.